between the same. Do you know that house, that, that place is not yours? It is mine. But I want from today, I want to, to move from that side, that place, to, to move where? To move, to move from that side, that place. I, I, I am Waxi Davis Jr. What's happened? You are said there is a, a day you are said. What's up guys? Uh, welcome back to our YouTube channel. My name is Dentani Senior254 and if you are watching me for the first time, kindly consider by subscribing to my YouTube channel at uh, Dentani Senior254. And uh, we are road to 2,000 subscribers guys. Thank you very much for the returning uh, subscribers who usually come and support me. They watch my videos, they push uh, until uh, we reach where we are. Thank you very much. Be blessed, guys. Today, this video, this video wanna be fire, fire, fire. Why am I saying so? I'm going to give you the, a brief story of uh, uh, David Jr.'s new home. You know, guys, when I tell you that people are bad, people are scammers. You keep on saying that, oh, we are jealousy. We don't love people. We are coming from that village and we know what we are speaking about. Mm. The new home of David Jr. I want you to get me uh, step by step. The new home that David Jr. Uh, recorded a video and lied to you that he bought a new home where he wants to build I don't know to renovate that new home uh, there is a donor who wanted to support uh, David Jr's uncle and uh, that donor said that donor said uh, I want to support your uncle maybe by buying him uh, a land or build him build a small house for him that is the that is a brother to congrats mom the uncle now that you saw moving in with david jr into a new home that guy is an uncle to david jr a brother to congrats mom this story is so sad very sad guys very 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 sad when that donor donated the money david jr now use the name of the uncle who goes by the name Ibrahim. He said that now uncle, what I want to do, my my do, my donor, actually that donor is from David Jr. He's a, he's a David Jr.'s donor. Uh I want to go and buy a new a home and uh plus a land, then you live there, you stay there, so that he can record a video just post and satisfy the donor that he has done something uh, or he has done a thing that uh, the donor wanted to be but the public other people around knowing that the land and the house are for david jr but the truth is here the uncle himself has said that land and the, the home was bought because of him he is the one who was given that land. He is the one who was being given that home. David Jr. took him. He's using him as a mirror. He went and placed him there. Make a video and post on YouTube saying that I have bought a new home. And take the video he sent to a donor and tell him that I have already bought a house and a land to my uncle as you wished. Now... Uncle stayed there for one month. The way he's saying, because I'm going to put the clip down there, then you see, guys. Then you see. He told, he, David Jr. actually has grabbed the land and the home from that uncle. That land and that home is not for David Jr. David Jr. has grabbed the land from his uncle. That's a brother to congrats, ma'am. And congrats, ma'am, is just there, keep keeping very quiet. When I tell you that those people are chameleons, you guys, you keep on thinking that we are biased, we are jealous. Mm. 
this is the video that I'm going to put. I'm going to put the video. Then you tell, you judge. If the uncle, a man at that age, cannot lie, after staying there for one month, that's the reason why I told you, the day that Mara went there for a party at their home, David Jr. was not around and the dad, those two people were out dealing with their uncle, taking the clothes, shoes, and everything, throwing outside, sending him away. Because why did they do that? The uncle now started to prepare the compound because he knows that that land is his. He knows that that land is his. The sponsor said, can you buy a land and a home for the, or build a home? Actually, he was to buy a land and build a home for the uncle. Now, David Jr. went shortcut and bought an old home with the same time with land and give it to the uncle. Now the uncle started to make cleanliness around the compound, knowing that this is now my home. When the dad and David Jr. realized that this guy, the uncle now, uh, is now starting to make compound clean and saying that it's the home, they see, before the time goes far, let me chase this guy out of the house. Let me throw the things, the shoes, the clothes, and that, that was the... That was uh, uh, David Junior's dad. That's the one who was doing there. The pastor. Which pastor are you? That was the pastor. When the man went to explain to Congressman, Congressman uh, told him that uh, we are not. I'm not going to help you because my fa my uh, husband and David Junior, their angers are up. They are not going to listen from me. Even leaving that guy to stay there as he looked for a plan. He, they gave him a maximum of three days. Mm. They gave him a maximum of three days to live out of that house. Three days. The fourth day, that was the day that there was a party in the home. The dad came and David Jr. They took all the properties of that guy. They threw them outside. That guy has slept outside for one day and the rain was raining outside there. He decided to take, to take his uh, belongings and go back where he was. He's a carpenter. The place that where he's working, he's usually sleep in the same, same house where he's working. So there is a lot of dust and whatever. Now, through camera and here and there, when they were recording videos with David Jr., one donor realized that this guy has got a problem of a land and a house. He decided to support him. After sending money to him, to Devi, Devi went a shortcut and bought an old house to give that man. Now he has chased him away. He has grabbed the land. He has given him three days not to be seen around together with the pastor. And the congressman usually pray each and every day. The congressman, which church, you... <laughs> You guys, I usually, I usually wonder why, why, why do you go to church? Which kind of heart do you have? Because if your brother is being, uh, is being thrown out, the, the things are being thrown out. The the dad was almost even beating him. That's disrespectful. How can I beat a brother to my wife? You don't even respect your in-laws. He was almost even fighting him. And he does not even know how that, how that land came to that guy. David Jr. has changed. Has changed as a chameleon. Now he's saying that this land is mine. This is not yours. This house is mine. But the, the guy himself, you know, despite that we are far from the village, we are undercovers and the DCI. We are doing investigation each and every day to know how the village is going on. Now the guy has decided to call me because I used to buy beds there when I was doing charity, building some houses, build a house at home there. He has called me. He has explained to me. Then I told him, can you make a video? And this video is the one that I'm going to place there, guys. You watch. Today I'm making a video of a very, I'm very serious actually because what these people are now doing 
it's not going to be more good to them i, I don't know why they are going to church you have you have bungalows you have a lot of lands you just you just want to grab the small land and the old houses from your uncle the worst part is a brother to congressman that's the worst part if we could be a, a worker who was doing a job at your family that one could be understandable but your real 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 uncle the dad fight the ill and he call himself pastor you keep on going church each and every day i've now realized where the bad heart is come from the dad is the source that's why david junior has copied that what are you doing to your uncle can you take land i i i just urge the donor the sponsor who bought that land for the uncle kindly can you intervene can you get into that situation and help this guy can you support him because you are the one who bought land for him you bought land and a house for him david junior is now lying to you telling you that this is my new home guys you, you, if you actually i'm i'm really wondering because the way that guy was talking with confidence welcome to my home my new home that home and the land was bought for the uncle now david junior because the uncle does not does not have a phone he does not even talk uh he have a small phone that a button one he has did he does not even talk a fluent english he is not learned actually he's just doing a carpentry now david junior took advantage of it even the time that we were buying the land david junior was writing his names there as a land buyer and tell him that because you are my uncle let me just buy land for you with my documents then you will just live in here he has now grabbed it abruptly from nowhere just changing from nowhere chameleons the worst part the dad was involved almost fighting the in-law and telling him that uh, i don't i'm just giving you two to three days to clear from this area to go where you have left the house just staying alone and you call yourself good hearted what where when you guys your stories are very disgusting we are here to support and protect our village we have to speak the reality we can't keep quiet and because uh bro whom do you think you are you guys what you, i don't know what you, you know sometimes i imagine for the people who loves you and you hate your family and Komo, you did the same to him. He fought from every corner, fighting from every corner, here and there, here and there, here and there, until he built his own ho home. Hmm? You guys, you were there, raising the cameras, doing this and this. You never thought Uncle Mo, you, you never opened a YouTube channel for him, until the time when Ponte came and Uncle Mo explained to him, one, two, three, he opened a YouTube channel for him. You hate your people. You hate your blood. If you hate your blood, will you really love us? You guys, I, I, I usually sympathize with the people who usually go there and call themselves Team Marwa, Team Devi Jr. I don't know, Team... You guys, those people are chameleons. And I tell them for free, fame is for the time. There is time that we reach, we will no, we'll no longer be talking about you. Other stars are coming. Other people are coming. Don't think that because now you are in this platform, this is your time. Can you roll? But it will reach a time that people will no longer speaking about you. Will be no longer listening to your video. Will be no longer watching you. Because the way things are going. And God has, God is seeing you. God, God is seeing you. God is seeing you. God is seeing you. You know? And the reason why I'm saying so, the pastor himself, that's the dad to Kong, the dad to David Jr. The pastor himself is the one who was doing that scene. Taking the clothes of your in-law. <laughs> you guys, you are cast. Taking your clothes of your in-law, shoes, throwing them away. Ah, so disgusting, guys. So my idea was because they have grabbed already they have already grabbed the land they have already chased him away he's now living in a a a place that is not well made with a 
dust inside and that's the where he's working from just uh, that small small money for eating you did it in a wrong way congress mom she is accepting that for their family she is the one who is almost she is the one who just uh she is a, a one who is uh, somehow rich now she is fearing to defend any of their uncle because they will chase him they will chase her because they, they, they have already talked to that uh, uncle he told me i called him he told me that when he tried to explain to congress mom congress mom told him that i'm not going to help you because these people they are bad they they want to even beat me that's the life that congress mom is now going through do do you think that you have chased my brother even congress mom she is feeling bad inside it's only that she cannot do anything congress mom is real real suffering in that compound because the brothers are being beaten the sons are, are they have chaos each and every day the dad himself guys so my idea was if you are a good hearted and we want to shame this family we want to shame them by maybe supporting this guy to build a just a, a slope house to buy a small piece of land and build a, even a, a mud house so that he can have his own home we want to shame him because the reason why that guy called me i told him how do you want me to help you he told me kindly you can publish this video so that people can chip in and support me so guys the video i'm going to put there you watch that clip under that video i'm going to place his number a uh, phone number there and the name so that you guys you can support him directly me i'm in nairobi you can use any person who is doing charity in the village a shame the family build a slope house for that guy hmm? people who are against that family can you let us shame him shame that family because they have grabbed the land of that guy and their home kindly support him support him support him i'm going to pull the video down here you watch and the number of that guy communicate to him directly i don't want even to be involved directly or you can look for a there is a many uh people who are doing charity in the village look for them send them to that guy they manage the house a mud house is less than 200000 a mud house is less than 200000 kenyan shillings even 150 we can look for a small land you build their mud house we plaster the guys start to live we are shame those people because what they have done to him is no longer good and god is seen we are here we will see we will see if the fame is going to stay forever that's very wrong Mm. actually today's video is like i'm sad um the story is very disgusting mm. guys kindly kindly if you want to shame that family can you do that thing there is a number that i'm going to place there for that guy directly communicate with them tell them because I'm going also to talk to I'm going to also to reach him by tomorrow. You will never know we are not in the village but we are there spiritually daily. We walk here and there, we move here and there and we don't fear. Mm. And don't think that we are doing these videos because we are away, we are we are hiding in Nairobi. No. Mm. We will come in the village. We will meet one on one. And for goodness with me, I'm working with evidence. That's the reason why I'm going to put the video there. Try and watch it, guys. Then you tell me. Junet is uh, another day. The Junet said they is uh, getting a sponsor, a sponsor from uh, from America. The Junet said, "Yeah, my sponsor. I want to." To, yeah. to help me like a house. Yeah. And uh, David Jr. 
He said he want to help me. There's a, a day the Dune say, today you are the one I am buy for you house up there. There's another day the Dune said, today you are the one to to move from this house from to this compound. Yes. My father, we went to, to stay to that house we are paid for you. I am I am went to to stay that that place for from Tereo Teretano to, to, to one month. Yeah. It's another day the junior say Do you know that house that, that place is not yours? It is mine. But I want from today I want to, to move from that side, that place, to to move where? To move to move from that side, that place. I I, I am Waxi Dave Junior. What's happened? You are said there is a, a day you are said you are buy for me. There is a somebody suppose us is a buy for me that 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 place. Why you are saying that place will is yours? But party the junior said from today this place is not yours. If you don't want to move to this place, you will see what can you what's happened. I am waiting for three days. A father of Father Dave Junior he came. He took, he opened the door. He wanted to carry my my things to, to rush outside. Yeah. I am asking, what is happened? He said, this place is not work. But he, I think today, if I am come to the next, the, the second round, you, are, you can see some, what is happened. Yeah. But he, I am wondering, what can you do? I am coming from ah uh, from my home. I am taking many things like uh, tools, like like uh, there is not the junior. The junior say that place is not mine. Yeah. A father of the junior, he came to guard everything outside. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I think, guys, you have watched the video. Even you can tell. Is that really good? Is how people should do things? Is how we should live? David Jr. is a, is a, a camouflage, a chameleon. And the worst part, even the dad was involved in that case, throwing the clothes outside. You are sleeping in a multi-million, in a multi-billion house, mansion. Why are you disturbing these small, small people? You have a lot of lands. Maro has bought almost all village. You have a lot of lands. The other side, Nyabohansi, you have land, but you are just crying for this small land that the, the Mze is living, the uncle is living. Why can't you leave your mom's brother? Even your mom could, could uh, intervene and say, no, 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 this is my brother. Maybe I can even pay you money if you want, as long as he live here. Your bloody brother being chased and you are just comfortable keeping quiet. Tomorrow is on Sunday, then you go to church plus your pastor. That pastor who was chasing... You guys, that's so, so disgusting. So disgusting. Wow. So guys, uh, thank you very much uh, for always supporting my video. This was one of the sad, sad, sad news video because you have also seen what the dad uh, and the team have done to the uncle of Dave Jr. Uh, kindly guys, uh, go and support that guy. Uh, even paying uh, rent for him for more than two months so that he can stay uh, somewhere or uh, paying rent for because the rent in Yabuhansa village is very cheap 2,000 Kenyan shillings 2,500 Kenyan shillings you can get a house and stay so 2,000 Kenyan shillings you guys you can contribute contribute each and every time and uh, get to pay a, at least even a year then that guy settled there from there now he will look for a way to do we need just to shame that family we need to ashamed the Virginia and the dad. What they did is very wrong. We condemn it. Very wrong. So guys, uh, thank you very much for watching my video until the end. 
may god bless you abundantly go and check on that guy kindly i've already pinned the number down there uh go and uh support him support him guys support him support him support him pay rent for him because he has got utensils they threw them out on the mat the way he's explaining i think he has just explained the shallow part the way he called me and explaining to me was more deeper more deep more painful i'm just feeling what he, he has already told me guys so thank you very much support my video guys and uh go and check on uh, daughter purity daughter purity i'm going to put the link down there you support her because uh she requested to be supported and uh, because i'm doing a reaction and with her she's doing a uh, vlogs so kindly guys go and check on her support her may god bless you abundantly abundantly see you in the next video on fire bye bye tomorrow the video might not be there because on sunday i'll be on church let us meet on monday fire fire power power see you guys kudos my team